Hi all, welcome to Geneso IT Trainings. My name is Sagar. Uh, today we'll be looking at installation of Mobaxtum. Before doing it, I would request everybody to subscribe my channel. And uh, so let us start looking at the installation of Mobaxtum. Before that, uh, let us try to understand what is the purpose of installing Mobaxtum. The purpose of installing Mobaxtum is uh, to, to make sure whatever Linux servers that we are trying to launch. So in order to connect to those Linux server, will be using uh, this particular application called as Mobaxtum. So is this the only application that we have? There are n number of applications where you can make use of to connect to the uh, Linux servers. So some of them would be, you know, I personally use Mobaxtum. And in real time, most of the companies in most of the organizations, they use Putty. And we have Excel. And we have Git Bash also. These are the tools that, uh, these are the applications uh, which are helpful to connect to the Linux servers. And so I personally prefer using Mobaxtum because of its, uh, uh, because I feel it more convenient to use it. So let's start looking at the installation of it. And in order to install, uh, install, open your favorite browser and open Google. And type the Mobaxtum here. And this would be the first link, uh, you know, that we have it here, you know, which is the official Mobaxtum uh, website. Open it and click on the download section. And as uh, we are using for our home edition or for our personal use, so I would recommend you to go ahead with the home edition rather than going ahead, going ahead with the professional edition. So this would be sufficient for us to work on the Linux servers. So the moment you click on the download now, uh, you'll be able to uh, see two options. One is portable edition and the second one is installer edition. What is this portable edition? This portable edition, you know, it's, it's, it's a, uh, it's uh, the name itself is self-explanatory where uh, you can copy the files in it into your pen drive and you can make use of the Mobaxtum in a different system also. So it's portable, you know, you can simply download and extract it. You'll be getting an executable. You can open the Mobaxtum then and there itself. So this is an installer edition, uh, which will install the Mobaxtum on our operating system. And so that, you know, the shortcut of it will be available on the desktop and you can make use of it. So I'll be using the installer edition. You click on it so that it starts downloading and uh, the download, the download is completed. Let me open it and let me cut it and put it in a different folder. Extract. Okay, so this is the, after extracting, I'll be getting this folder, and inside this folder, you have the installer edition. So click on this installer edition, where it will start for the installation of the Mobaxtum. Click on the next, and click on I accept. Click on next, and choose the path, whichever path you would like to select. You know, wherever you want it, you want Mobaxtum to be installed, you can select it. I'll just leave it to the default path to be installed. Click on next and click on the install. Click on the S here. And the installation of it is, uh, yeah, it's completed. See, it's it's very simple. Uh, the installation of Mobaxtum is very simple. And click on finish. The moment you do it, you know, um, if I'm not wrong, I think you should be able to see uh, on the desktop. See, look at this icon here. I know there's so many icons on my desktop. Uh, it looks so dirty, so it's okay. Um, you have this Mobaxtum, you know, which you are, you'll be able to see on your desktop. This is the icon of the Mobaxtum. You click on it and open the Mobaxtum. So, if you're able to open Mobaxtum, if you're able to see the screen, then it means that you have successfully installed Mobaxtum. Uh, I think this is the installation of Mobaxtum and which is helpful to connect to the Linux servers. Uh, I'll try to show it to you how can we connect to the Linux servers in my next videos. Uh, thank you so much. That's all for this video. And I would request everybody to subscribe my channel. Thank you.